Anti-Corruption Commission has today announced that the fight against corruption in the country had registered remarkable achievements after the anti-graft body recovered some 488 million shillings lost through graft. The commissioners, Commission's chairman, retired Archbishop Eliud Wabukala, said that the ASCC was in the process of tracking 14 illegally acquired public assets estimated to cost 2.3 billion shillings, Okokosa reports. Speaking in Vihiga County during celebrations to mark the International Anti-Corruption Day, Wabukala disclosed that the Commission had made an application in court seeking the preservation of assets estimated at 2.6 billion shillings. Last year, we had, uh, we, have, we, have acquired, we took public assets, which people are taken, worth 2.3 billion. We also recovered cash, 488 million. We also looked at uh, preserved assets, worth 2.6 bi billion. He said that through 12 proactive covert investigations, ESCC had managed to avert a possible loss of more public funds, estimated at 4.7 billion shillings this year. Wabukala further revealed that the Commission had finalized 183 files on corruption and economic crime and forwarded the same to the Office of the Director of Public Prosecutions. Out of which 135 were recommended for prosecution. 14 were for administrative action and 34 for closure. The commission forwarded four files on ethical breaches to the, to the DPP. 49 cases were finalized in court, resulting in 39 convictions. The Higa County Governor Wilbao Tichilo and his Kisi counterpart James Ongwai, who attended the event, called on the government to deal ruthlessly with those found culpable of graft. <laughs> sheria zetu ili kwamba ufisadi iwe capital punishment ukipatikana na ufisadi capital punishment inasema kwamba ufungwe maisha ama unyongwe huko kusa ntv